In 2012, the two, Chris Okema and Samuel Gishuru, through their lawyer Fred Ngatia, had requested to have the corruption cases transferred to the Kenyan High Court and not proceed in the courts of the island of Jersey. Ngatia had also requested to have the case dismissed because it had been instituted and procedurally. The two were also challenging Tobiko's power to initiate extradition proceedings against them, claiming they were fatally defective. Okema and Gishuru also argued that it was unreasonable for them to be prosecuted for offenses allegedly committed over 20 years ago. Nairobi Senior Principal Magistrate Teresia Murugi in her ruling cited that the Attorney General powers were reduced under the new constitution, hence the DPP had powers to take over the cases. Tobiko had authorized the extradition proceedings following the request by United Kingdom in accordance with the Commonwealth Extradition Act. Okemo is also vying to become the next senator of Busia County and his co-accused Gishuru were last year each released on a one million cash bill and ordered to surrender their passports in court. The chief justice had issued a warrant of arrest for Okemo and Gishuru in 2011 following accusations against Okemo and Gishuru for receiving up to 900 million shillings in bribes from companies interested in contracts in the energy industry. It is alleged that money was paid into accounts held by a firm known as Windward Trading Limited, allegedly owned by Gishuru and Okemo. The offense, the two, if charged in Jersey, carries a maximum of 14 years in jail. Winnie Kamau, KTN.